Looks like Gade's curious about Ethereal Legion, so Angel can quickly drop that down there. If you do want to come up and speak on Ethereal Legion stuff, feel free. <laughs> Bartender Bird, if you go to the SKL uh, official YouTube channel, you can see some of uh, Peanut's old stuff, which is pretty funny. All right. Hello, everyone. Uh, so with Tiyashi being gone, I am the last remaining in the Ethereal Legion. Uh, and it's been kind of on the back burner for a little while, and it's time for it to come back. Uh, I've already started to ask people to message me if they want to attend the next tryout. I don't know when it's going to be, but I know I want to hold one relatively soon. Uh, I've been trying to figure out when I want to start holding uh, operation nights for the ghosts once they've passed the uh, once they've passed the the tryout. Uh, so there's still a lot of stuff in the works. As now I there's a lot of stuff that I had wanted to do in the past, but now now I you know I I have the power. I have the power to do it. Um, get the power. I got the power. And so hopefully you're gonna start seeing more, more clerk, more, more ghosts going around. Some more sneaky beaky people. Lots more uh, mischievous charades going on. Some shenanigans. You know oh, me. I love shenanigans. shenanigans. That's oh, like yeah. that's like my thing, man. I love shenanigans. If I'm not laughing, I'm not doing it right. Uh, so yeah, if you're interested. We have the Ethereal Legion down there. Let me just go ahead and give everyone a link. For the folks who don't know what the Ethereal Legion is, it is um, a long-standing group within SKL uh, for, I guess, over two years now. Yeah. It's quite old. Um, um, that does basically all that infiltrator stuff. So they hack shit, they snipe shit, they scout shit. They basically, as a small squad, are able to do the work of multiple squads by rapidly moving and doing things behind enemy lines. Very cool. Um, and great, great bunch of people. Tayashi was formerly Papa Spook. I suppose, I don't know if Papa Spook, we have to retire that title. I feel like we kind of have to. Uh, but I don't know what else, what other title we should use. It will always be his title. It will forever be. No, she will always be Papa Spook. We got to come up with something else for Angel. We'll figure it. You'll you'll figure it out. You guys will figure it out. The ghost with the most. Oh no! <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and step down. All right. All right, folks. Yep, check out a Theo General, and join up in that at your uh, at your convenience. Okay. Well, um, yeah, Prozen, should I just give a general gist? Alrighty, so basically, um, I think a lot of people today, certainly in our leadership, and, and probably at least some of y'all in, in the community, uh, were potentially expecting a Prozen outfit leader promotion today. Um, and that was the plan up until recently, when unfortunately IRL stuff has meant that Prozen's going to need to take a bit of a leave of absence. Uh, and will not be able to accept that promotion. So, um, yeah, basically, uh, Prozen's going to be uh, stepping away a little bit for a little while while he deals with that stuff IRL, um, and all of that will be, of course, uh, heavily looked at again um, when he he returns to to where he's been. But obviously, Prozen's been doing just an unimaginable amount of work um, recently, and just for the last couple years. I mean, the guy's a powerhouse of work. It'd, it'd be really hard to find anybody in SKL who's done more work than him, so definitely um, major recognition needed for, for him, and uh, and yeah, hopefully uh, that, LOA, that LOA goes well. Yeah, dude is on his phone at work, like, just tuning into minis. Even if he can't talk, he's there. He is there. He's always, you know how my fucking thing is seeing all, knowing all? It's kind of and I'm not true. Prozen's kind of seeing all, knowing all. Hey, Ross is here.
Airbit Press Plus promo. I don't know if we can do that, unfortunately, if that was a thing. Don't know if we can do that. Alrighty. Well, um, if anybody has any more questions, feel free to drop them. Um, otherwise, uh, we will we will end this meeting here. Anyone else? It's the time. It's time to deliver a pizza bowl. Actually, I got one thing if you don't mind me stepping in. Sure. A um, couple outfits in here. May or may not be aware. June 11th, there is a bashing class that the Emerald community outfits are agreeing to go to. So it's going to be in the off-continent, June 11th, 8 p.m. It's a Saturday. So it should be a lot of fun. If you can make time, try and show up. Even if you can't get on the continent where there's going to be bash that's being pulled, the freaking fights are probably going to be crazy. It's going to be a really good night online. But if you could get on the continent preemptively, we'll know, obviously, that day near that time. Um, it is a crazy amount of fun. Um, definitely something that would, it's like team pulling bash, except all the factions are doing it. it. It's super crazy. I've only been to two. This will probably be the third one. Um, so just Hell, something yeah. to look forward to. Yeah, that, I, I remember when Bastions first dropped and we had the first Bastion expansion. It was so damn good. You gotta go to these things, man. They're, they are so much fun. And we gotta fucking win. We gotta beat the shit out of those Bastions. We gotta not get orbital like last time. <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> Please, 11th, hopefully. APM, any updates? Check Flash News. Alrighty, thank you, Mike. Um, I do see, uh, Trimax, you dropping a question. Is there any possibility of VSD people joining back? So basically, um, I, I would say this. Uh, right now the goal is establish good relations. Uh, we at least want them to feel comfortable rejoining our Discord, um, and they are comfortable with us joining their Discord already, which is great. Um, we want to get them into the Emerald Community Discord. We want to work together with them. Um, they obviously have every ability to join back. They are certainly not banned from the outfit. Um, and uh, but I think many of them are, are happy where they are. They they like their their sort of being able to to set their own destinies out in VSD in a new outfit, and that's good for the game. I mean, that's good for the community. It means we got more stuff going on, we got more potential for change, and and overall, I think it's it's not a a an issue uh, in any way, shape, or form. So yeah, I'll suggest. And and I will be clear because um, I saw some kind of immature shit in text chat earlier in the meeting, and let me be clear, we aren't going to be cool with that. All right. We aren't going to be cool with that, not from any of our members, uh, and especially our leaders, doing anything toxic related to it. Um, even even just slight aggressive stuff. Just just be be the bigger man, all right? If somebody says something you don't like, then you know what? Let, let them be clowned about it, rather than having to, to jump in with something. And if you're someone who's trying to start up some, some drama or something, then don't. Don't. Because nobody wants that. Nobody wants that. Overnight doesn't want that. He's smart enough not to want that. We don't want that. We're smart enough not to want that. Be a good, good chat, like Bert Tender says, all right? All right. Hopefully everybody's on the same page in regards to that. That's on both sides of that, whether you don't like them or do like them or whatever. Yeah, bygones be bygones. All righty. Well, thank you all once again for coming to this meeting. I really appreciate you all being here. I am very optimistic about SKL's future. Um, we've got a number of these new leaders now joining up with us. We've got uh, new Cerebrits. We've got new changes in the work. We're going to be changing things about the Discord. We're going to be looking into academies. We're going to be working things out. And overall, everything's still functioning pretty damn well overall. Uh, we got 895 starting up. we got a bunch of great stuff for you all. And it's going to be good, man. It's going to be good. We're going to keep growing. I mean, we still got a bunch of new community members. I see so many new people inside of this town hall chat who were not here at the last town hall. That on its own is a good fucking sign. That means shit's going well. 
Look, Lush is new. Welcome, Wasa. Skagi is spying for the TR. Uh, tell, tell Pale Tiger hello, and that I am deeply attracted to him. Um, I'm glad it's good to be here. All right. Well, that's all, folks. Have a good one. Peace.